What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Pokemon Rejuvenation, and happy Sunday. I hope your week's gone well, and you're looking forward to a new week. Today, we were at the Oceana Pier, but as I said in the last episode, we needed to catch a little Pokemon, which was down here. There you are. And now we have our Poke Snacks or whatever. God, let's corner you then. Blizzard? Do you want to give Blitzel a gourmet treat? Yes, I do. We need electric coverage. And I have kind of saved like about two minutes before walking over here. So should have probably done something before. But a level 18 is not bad at all. Okay. Can we just cop you as you are now? We have cell batteries, which could be really damn useful for you. It's attack will rise rather than special attack, but yeah, we'll find a way. Let's try a Pokeball. Let's spam B. And we get it first time. <laughs> Alright. New member of the team to start off. Uh, what do we call Blitzel? Sparking. Like uh, Sparking in the Dragon Ball Z intro. The original one, that is. But uh, yeah, new member of the team. Let's speed up through this. So we couldn't get down here to the Zygarde cell, and that was a strength. Unless there's an item hidden here. Anything? No? Okay. Do we have any hidden items around here? No. Uh, I can't really do much on speed up. Okay. Doesn't seem like any hidden items. Hmm. I don't even know if that would be hidden items. But uh, yeah, new member of the team. Let's have a look and see if we can rejig anyone. But today, I think we have to head to a new city. I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. But you know what? That doesn't matter. So we've got Milo, who will eventually become a Milotic, but we don't have much we can do with you right now until we get a Link Heart, I think is what it's called. This is what happens when I do stuff on the fly. <laughs> I just forget what the hell I'm talking about. Um, so we can either get rid of our flying coverage, but we have an evolution there. This is actually really tough. We might have to get rid of Nidorina until we get a Moonstone. And then we get Nidoqueen. Um, I know some people are going to be annoyed at me doing that, but I think that's what we do for the time being. Boomer, too low a level at the moment, you'll kind of just weigh us down. Dude, we do have uh, Lunatone in the team, so I think that's what we do there. And then Severus needs a heal because you got paralyzed. So, now we need to head... Back to the cave, I think, that we were in last episode. Although, we need to buy more Pokeballs and stuff, don't we? And maybe, can we get Super Potions or something now? No? Okay. Well, I am going to buy 10 of you. Give me a Premier Ball, please. Thank you. A uh, couple of Repels might be good. I don't think we need Antidotes for the cave. Potions, we got five off, so that's kind of okay. But let's make our way to the train station. Et voila! And now we have to go back through, I think. Eh? Okay, so we had to pay 300, so it's a good thing I didn't buy more. <laughs> but then we go back through this area. I'm um, pretty sure we battled everyone we could. So now it's just a matter of going back through the whole cave. All of the APOMs have been restored. Was there anything here? Another gourmet treat? We can't afford it now. It would be quite cool if these were discounted. For your journey, but you know, eh, it is what it is. So now, Amethyst Cave, warning, large crevices are present throughout the cave. Please proceed through the cave with caution. And the only way to go is up, I think. 
Oh, nice little surfy waterfall area. Are you going to want to battle? Have you been to Sheridan Village? It's a place that prides itself on peace and tranquility. Find your inner self and make peace with it. That is something that most people actually can't do. They'll teach you how to do that there. That's for sure. Okay, so does that mean... Oh, we got rid of... God damn it. Okay, someone has to learn Rock Smash. <laughs> and... Ooh, Ninja? Or Severus? Hmm... I guess we could get rid of Bubble? Hmm... Damn, that's annoying. Okay. But it's a TM, so we can unlearn it at any point. Which I probably will do. Once we get another better water move. There's also the uh, easy TMs or HMs passcode. Pom Pom Meadow. Okay. So we can't go through here. That may have been a waste of teaching a TM. But you know what? We move. <laughs> and so the only way to go is to the right. Does it fork off again? Is there an item? Or is there a hidden cave? No, nothing there. How's about here? Nothing? Okay, fine. Oh, it's the ghoul again. Who do we have up top? Severus? I think that is fine. What are you doing so far in the cave? Don't you know it's dangerous for babies to crawl out? Oh. Technician Edward. Alright. Okay, Edward. Oh, okay. One more bite. Nice and easy. Very good. Roly Coley. Um, I'm gonna let Ninja out for this one. Lovely. I didn't expect this much power. 200 as well. The ironic thing here is that I feel like crying like a baby. So, it seems like you failed. That's hardly a surprise. I tried to warn you. I tried to warn you three that this was a hopeless endeavor. But now, you know the pain of losing someone. That pain will stick with you forever. All right, electric gem. Oh, okay. Is there anything nice over here? Do we just smash and hope that there's something, or maybe an encounter? No, oh, that's probably a place of significance up there. No item? No hidden item? I'm trying to pick out the corners, but maybe not. Can we read that sign? No. We just venture deeper. Ooh. And another battle. I kind of don't feel like sparking is best in this cave, but I'm going to give him a go up top. I haven't even looked at his moves. I heard rumbling coming from the lower levels of the cavern. What's down there, I wonder? Rare Pokemon? Maybe a secret base? Oh, don't get me excited. Oh, there's a Zygarde cell. And there is something with a panel, which we definitely won't be able to get to just yet, but we are going to make a return to this cave eventually. It's dangerous for people to be inside such a treacherous cave like this. Oh, a battle? Uh, what? <laughs> you just go from being very concerned to, yeah, why not? Uh, I am going to Thunder Wave. Insta paralyze? No, okay. We are faster though, so double kick. Oh, very nice, very nice, very nice. Thank god we're not getting flinch axe there. Flame charge? Do we get a speed boost with this? We do. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I haven't used flame charge for ages. Since we had a Rapidash, actually, in Reborn. A Linoon. I will change... Shade? Shade should be pretty good here, actually. Okay, what? All right, cool. <laughs> Guess not. Uh, Luna. And then we side wave.
Oh my god, the flinch hacks. Are you kidding? Wow! Oh my god, that was terrible. Okay, Severus, I'm gonna pitch you back up. <laughs> and then, encounter. A Rubat. Eh. Eh. No light yet. Oh, this feels very story ish. Anyone else feel that? There's a rock climb? Okay. So there's definitely a lot we're gonna have to do at some point. A sand shrew. It's a shame you're so weak. But. Oh, this is a cool bridge. Who are you? Do I hit save? Uh, I did it anyway. Say cheese! Oh wait, I think I was supposed to say that before firing away. Oh well. Oh my god, what is this music? <laughs> that aside, I suppose you're in my memory banks now. Guess what? You've been randomly selected to participate in the fun games. Your prize for winning the game? Entrance to Sheridan Village. Let the fun games begin. Okay, I'm sorry, what? Hey, over here, this way. Welcome to the first game we're going to play. Hidden in a rock lies a special purple pebble. Try saying that five times faster. Choose one and destroy it. If there's a purple pebble found within a rock, you'll proceed. Easy enough, right? Wow, you got it. You found the purple pebble. Get it? Because you created the pebble by breaking down the purple rock. Heh <laughs> heh. Alright, game number one is over, let's move on. Okay, game number two, this one will be a bit more difficult. For the game, you'll need to choose which one is the fake tree. That's it, that's all. Let the games begin. Photosynthesis? Are you sure you got the right one? I'll give you another shot. Oh man, how'd you know? I thought my disguise was perfect. Wow, you got it again, that's super impressive. Off and on to the third and final game. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. Are we gonna have to battle? Because we're not we're not we're not in the best shape. Um Now, for the third and final game, I've been preparing this particular game for a while. For this game, we'll battle. I've been watching you for a while. I was there when you fought Venom. But no one noticed. I wanted to talk to you before then too, but it takes so much energy to be physically pre present that I just couldn't do it. The name's Nim, a traveling girl with a ton of vitality and spirit. We're going to be besties, okay? I won't take no for an answer. Oh, Jesus. Like, I'm glad I saved, but at the same time, we're just gonna have to go back and heal anyway. <laughs> and it's a double battle. Okay. Wait. Oh, we got fully healed? Oh, okay. I'll take that. Um, I'm going to Iron Tail you, Water Pulse you. Oh, and it one-shots. Thank you very much. Hardly any XP, but Iron Tail does a nice amount. Who did you put to sleep? Ninja, that's okay. So what I can do here is I can bite the Lunatone and I could switch in what could you potentially do to Ninja? it's a real thing, I could switch into my own Lunatone <laughs> uh, or I could go for a Shadow Sneak on the next turn and hope you hit with a normal move oh that's exactly what I'm doing <laughs> okay not even half oh this is gonna hurt a lot oh wow Right, cool. Um, uh, we go for a bite here, and we go for a shadow sneak. Good, take you down. Nice one. Okay, the NK we don't really have to worry about at all. I'm just gonna speed through all of this. Shade gets a level faint attack. I think is a definite. Never misses. Uh, oh, we always go last, so pain splits kind of annoying and too much of a gamble to survive 
so I'm just gonna switch that out. Oh! And you use faint attack. Fair play to you. Oh, okay. Um, I'm gonna shockwave you, and I will shadow. Uh, maybe faint attack. Just guaranteed no miss. Wow, that hurt. Okay. Um, let's go Lunar Tone. And we can shockwave again. And oh god, we can't do too much here. Uh, I could hypnosis the soul rock. Very good. Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, I am going to just echo voice, and we can go for a side wave, but we'll be asleep. Very good. And ooh, I don't even know. We could just get stronger and stronger with that. Wowzers. Okay. That does neutral, which is kind of cool. Uh, go for a water pulse. I doubt you'll wake up, but still. Same again. Come on. There we go. Last hit. <laughs> Had to be. And level 21. Trying to learn rock slide? Absolutely. Um, I'm going to get rid of Embargo. I think that's an easy choice, at least in my brain. Congratulations, you won the game! Hopefully you heal us, Jesus. Wowie, you won! You're top-notch, you know that? I never knew we were tied by fate the moment I saw you beat Venom. So cool! Heh, <laughs> but sorry. I have one last game to play. Here are the rules. Answer this question with the truth, no matter what it is. And that question is... Did I cheer you up? Yes. Yes! I wanted my first impression to be a real good one. That way, you wouldn't forget about me. Come chill with me for a sec. I know that Ren guy gave you the whole speech about grief and whatnot, but I thought I'd pitch in and spread the happiness or something. Okay, confession time. I was also watching you guys when you were fighting Zeta. I feel so bad because I wanted help, but I just... I couldn't. Anyway, when you three were dragged into the rift, Zeta threw Melia's bag off the side of the cliff. I decided to go down into the depths and look for it, and I found it. It had been completely destroyed by the water on the lower levels, but I was able to retrieve this. Room ID card. There wasn't anything else around, so... Sorry if I missed something. The world sucks a lot, I've been through some of its horrors myself. I was traveling with someone for a while, but we had to separate eventually. But you gotta keep staying weird and zany, or else this world just gets boring. There's so much out there, so much adventure. I want you to continue with your head held high. But yeah, sorry for dragging you here. I just wanted a chance to talk. I'm going to send you back now, okay? I believe in you. Don't forget about me. Nim, your bestie. Bye-bye. Okay, so I guess on a technicality, we could have been... Uh, we could have been stuck there. <laughs> but anyway, don't forget, I'll always be watching. I'm like your guardian angel. That's reassuring. Sheridan Village ahead. So, I feel like foreshadowing... She's going to die at some point if she's some sort of ghost or psychic or something. And she'll pass on to the afterlife to save us at some point. That's my guess. Ooh! Sheridan Village. Oh, this gives me some Legend of Zelda vibes. Oh, I like this a lot. It's hopeless, Eldest. Things are just too broken. It's been like this for an entire year, but now it's getting far worse. He won't come out to eat. Heck, he won't come out of his house in general. Staying inside all day isn't healthy. He's neglecting all of his duties. I'm sure the sensei has his reasons. He's lived a complicated life. Something that only he can understand, but Sheridan Village is a place of community. 
We're here for him. I'm here for him. Why won't he just trust me? It's been said time and time again that if the leader of Ser Sheridan Village isn't in sync with his people, it will fall. In all my time in this village, this has happened once before, and even through that dark hour, we rose victorious in the end, standing strong. So please believe me when I say things are going to be all right. Okay, I'll put my faith in you, eldest. For now, the inn needs me. I'll head back now, as you wish. Oh dear. Hmm? So, they finally made their way to this village. This is where it will all begin. Oh, please excuse my rude disposition. I was just taken aback. Welcome to Sheridan Village. If you're looking for a place to stay, I run the inn just northeast of here. Good day to you. Okay. Well, it looks like we got some stuff to explore. Oh! Be one with the mind, body, and soul. Oh god, we are not... Are we healed again? Okay, we're healed again. There's a good bit of hand-holding so far in this game. Uh, I'm gonna Iron Tail. This could hurt. Yep, there you go. First time paralysis, as always. I don't know why I Iron Tail. How about a Poison Tail this time? Much better. One more of them, please. Just what the doctor ordered. Boom. Very nice. What else have you got? Oh, lovely level. Togedomaru. I shall switch. Uh, let's try out Rock Slide. Oh, that really hurt Luna. Okay, that did not go as I wanted. This is gonna hurt. Okay, I want some XP for you. So I will do the old switcheroo. Oh, okay. Uh, flame charge. And then one more flame charge. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Oh, that's a lot of XP for a token tomorrow. You are clearly in line with all three. The mind, body, and soul. Hell yeah. Good luck on your journey. Thank you. I was hoping to find somewhere to heal. Uh, but turns out we didn't need it. So how do we get to that item? Hopefully there's a side entrance. Okay. Can't rest here. Doesn't look like there's anything to interact with. I can't get enough of the fresh air. Life is practically perfect, even in old age. Item? No. Okay. Oh, a campfire. I can't sit on it properly, but that's alright. Please enjoy what Sheridan Village has to offer. If you need a place to stay, please consider the Cherry Blossom Inn. Is it going to cost an arm and a leg? So can we just walk in and... Ooh. Hello, Kalia. So we can't sleep there. And that looks locked. Okay. I stay the night 450. Jeez. Okay. Supply closet. Do you happen to have an iggly buff? No, I don't. I am so sorry. Can we sleep in your bed? Nope. Damn. There's got to be a Pokemon Center somewhere, right? Nothing there. How's about here? No. How's about here? No. Damn. It's got to be an item or something, right? What am I to do? It's been ages since... Oh, oh. Oh my, how long have you been here? Um, since you're here, would you mind lending me your ear? Sure. Ah, thank you. But I think I should introduce myself before I continue. My name is Dara. I live here with my boyfriend, but my boyfriend and I like to pick special plants that live underneath the soil in Amethyst Cave for tea. Recently, he went to Amethyst Cave to grab some himself, but he hasn't been back in a few days. We usually go to Amethyst Cave t 
to gather them together. But I was busy with work this time around. The trip to Amethyst Cave only takes a couple of hours. He should be back by now. I don't have any Pokemon myself, so I can't go out looking for him. Would you mind looking for him in my place? Of course, I'll reward you in some way. Sure. The spot we usually go nearby is nearby a tiny waterfall. Ah, oh, okay. We did walk past it on the way. Can I sleep? No. Damn it. There will be a Pokemon Center somewhere. Let's talk to you. When you're in battle, you must be focused on your opponent. You can't afford to be snoozing around, waiting for things to go in your favor. What are you looking for? Worry Seed, Uproar... Oh. Okay. It's a weird collection of, uh... Damn! I was gonna say, it's a weird collection of, uh, things to be offering. But it would be shards anyway, I think. Severus. This is an okay matchup. Although we are paralyzed. Come on. Nice. I don't think we hold on for another one, though. Damn. Okay. Uh, Packers has this in the bag. Easy. Very nice. Okay. Um, no. For Mantis? We might be okay here too. Hmm, maybe not. Oh, so close yet so far. Sparking. It's a flame charge job. Easy. Uh, far fetched? Shockwave. Oh, that didn't do a lot to you. I do love the sprite though. Uh, we are getting ransacked. Shade. Faint attack. Oh, wow. Alright, no messing around. There we go. Jeez. Okay, you're absolutely disgusting. What did I do? You should be kinder. Okay. If you say so. Uh, there's a lot of people that want to battle. And there isn't many places to heal. I'm guessing this is a daycare center? So we can do an old switch room now. Which I feel like we really need to do. You can raise one of your Pokemon. Do we want to raise anyone? We could put Milo in and come back later. I don't, I don't trust my own memory <laughs> to remember to bring you back. Um... Oof. Yeah, that's an awkward one. Uh, you're gonna wanna fight. You want to fight as well? God damn it. Okay, we may die. Oh my god. Okay. Monferno. Please one shot. Thank. God. Okay. Oh. Okay, we can get super potions now, which is good. We can get great balls as well, reverse candies, I don't think we need. Uh, a mm, couple of them. I won't get a great ball for now, but we do need to go and heal, so we are going to have to stay at the inn. I didn't mean to do that, but... Okay. Do you survive a water pulse? No. Damn. Oh, bother. Oh, thank goodness, I was worried sick. Gah! I'm sorry for shouting like that. My name is Samantha. It's just, my sister has gone on an expedition to an island called Terajuma Island, and, look, she was supposed to be back a few days ago, but she isn't. I'm sorry, but if you're here to teach moves to your Pokemon, it'll have to wait. I mean, I could do it, but I'm not as good as her so it won't be as efficient. Okay, whatever. I was looking for somewhere to hopefully heal. But... Terajuma Island. Sounds kind of fancy. 
Uh, I'm just gonna go heal now. Uh, no, that's not it. Where was it? 450 a night, my god. We do have the money. Okay, good. Who? We hope you had a wonderful night at our own. Please do consider staying again. Do we get a discount this time? Nope. Okay. <laughs> oh, Christ. So there's something in there. You don't want to fight? Okay. Need a lift to Girin City. Good for now. But that is kind of clutch. Uh, side entrance. Why should this be where I could have slept? Please disregard my granddaughter's rudeness. She's only trying to look out for me. Oh, excuse me, but this is our private living space. You can't just walk in front, in from that way because the door's unlocked. Now, now, no need to be so unwelcoming, Nadia. When I was younger, trainers used to enter my home at random as well. I know, Grandma, but I'm just trying to protect you. What if some creep just decided to waltz into our home? What then? I'm sure our Pokemon would protect us. It's no problem at all, dear. If you say so. Hey, kid. I know I yelled at you for walking in here, but I want you to have this courtesy of me. Super potion! Okay. Well, we got three anyway now. <laughs> How nice of them. So, I'm guessing we need to... Oh, we need to get cut in order to get to there. And does this take us back? Sorry, but this gave it... gate is currently undergoing lodge renovations. Please come back at a later time. Okay. So we can't climb up there. Um, we can go into a cave, though. And no one stopped us. And then... What was this? Ah, oh, okay. Oh, wait, what? So it just loops us around? Okay, fine. That's kind of weird. You're going to want to fight? No? Pretty sure place, huh? Let's ruin that. Okay, we had to speak to you. God, you almost got me. Ordino. This is some lovely levels. Um, kind of want shade coming out for this. There's an effect, sucker, will o wisp. Oh, and you have nothing for me. Lovely. Knock off. Oh wow. They really aren't doing much. It's a slow burner. <laughs> Get it? Slow burner. Hmm. We're still faster. And you have nothing for us. Wow. Okay. Haha, <laughs> we caught the uh, AI off guard here. Mien Fu have some of this. And another one. God, this is really taking down our PP. Okay, very good. Lovely. Ordino. Back at it again. Knock off. And one more. Oh, yes, please. Small XP candies. Alright. I do not mind if I do. So you're just... Oh, I can just challenge you all the time? Sign me up for that. Um... Let me get small XP candies? I am more than happy with that. So I might just speed up through this. Grab some levels. Get everyone to... I don't know, 24, 25? Okay. So I gave a couple of the uh, small XP candies out. They're 800 XP each. So now we have a Hootoot. God, this is a slow evolution when you don't speed up. Let's get to it.
wow, that took ages. Okay. Noxow! Hell yeah. Um... God, that makes this really easy. Trying to learn Pursuit? Sign me up. Um... Flex double... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Do we want to get rid of double kick? It's nice to have the fighting coverage. Um... Actually, we've got dark moves on Shade. That's fine. Uh, and our team's looking alright now. So we can sort of venture up here. Uh, who do we put up? We still need to give Pekka some levels. So... I will no longer stand for this silence. Okay, three Pokemon. Peck. God, you're still not doing all that much. Oh. God, Pekka's just ain't cutting it, is he? One shot. Damn, you're faster. <laughs> Jesus, okay. Flame charge. Another one. And another one. Wow, okay. I really hope we get a decent amount of money. Uh, shade. Boom. What a wisp. Hex. Nice. Okay. Very good. Uh, item? No. Oh. Oh, there is something that's going to go down here. Oh, you're a new face around here. Did you just make it to Sheridan? Yes. My name is Elita. I help run the Cherry Blossom Inn. I assume you're here because you want to challenge the Sensei to a battle, right? I don't think you're going to have much luck there. The sensei is pretty distant. Lately, he hasn't even spoken to the villagers. But I guess I can't stop you. Hopefully it works out. Okay. Is there anything around here? Oh, we can encounter these? Level 20 Swablu. You could be pretty useful. I might just catch you because I can. Or can I? We'll see how difficult they are to catch. Where are my Pokeballs? There they are. Spamby. Okay, nice and easy. <laughs> like to give a nickname? Uh, nah, I'll leave that for now. Uh, anything else around here? No. A shiny Swablu would be pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. But, uh... Knock? No one's answering. Perhaps it's best to come back later. Oh, I would have loved to just pester him until he's like, What do you want? Oh my god, leave me alone. But I guess not. Uh, who should we put up top for the next battle? Shade. It's going to take a while for you to evolve, but might as well get you some more levels. 25 the max anyway. Timber. Will I wisp? Oh, this is going to... Okay. Didn't do as much as I thought. Very nice. Staravia. You're definitely going to have something that's going to hurt us. Like that. Uh, sparking. Can we get off a shockwave? Nope. Uh, Luna. Rock slide. Oh, so close. Oh! Okay. And there is virtually nothing else for us to do here. What does this guy want? Nothing? Okay. Daycare man. Yeah, whatever. Um, so there ain't all that much to do. Ah, ma'am. Would you please send extra sheets to my room? It gets quite chilly at night, and these frail old bones can't take it. Yes, Miss Apple. I'll bring you some before bedtime, okay? Thank you, darling. Such a delightful child. The sensei must be proud to have people like you in Sheridan Village. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh gosh, I just realized I never asked for your name back there. Ah, Killian. What a lovely name. Thank you. Zeta thought otherwise. <laughs> Did you have any luck with the sensei? I, I see. 
I expected as much. I'm very sorry about that. He's been neglecting his duties as of late. It's hard for him to open up to people. But I still believe in him. I won't stop believing in him. Listen, Killian, do you mind helping me with something? I'll be upstairs. Everything will be explained then. Okay. Do we get a free heal at all? No? Okay. Well, I'm just gonna hit save here just in case she wants to battle. Ah, you actually showed up. Thank you so much for visiting me here in my room. God, my mouth didn't work there. I don't spend much time in here, so there's not much, but... Alita, what did you want to speak to me about? Oh, I see. Please excuse me. I don't think we've introduced ourselves back when. I'm the eldest of this village. I am also the sensei's advisor. It's a pleasure to meet you, Killian. Oh, you already knew Killian's name? I thought you said you haven't introduced yourself. Ah, well, well, I overheard you calling their name while I was outside, but it matters not. What did you need? Oh yeah, I wanted to explain to Killian about our situation. Killian came to participate in the gym challenge, but... Yeah. <laughs> ah, say no more, Killian. First and foremost, I want to apologize for Kater's behavior. Kater is our sensei. He has been for over 10 years now, but in the past year or so, something has happened to him. Suddenly, he came home after a long trip with a face as white as snow. Ever since then, he's secluded himself within his house, which brings me to why I asked you here. For the past couple of weeks, I've tried confronting sensei on my own, but each time it's ended in failure or my dismissal. Please, Killian, will you help me confront Sensei? Hmm? I've been trying to get through to him for months now. But if Killian is there with me, I'll have someone to back me up. Besides, if this works out for Killian too, I can get Sensei to come to his senses. Killian can get the battle they came here for. So what do you say, Killian? Yeah, sure. Really? You will? I knew you'd say yes. If you're the one to help me, I know this can't fail. But why Killian? What about Killian has led you to this? It's hard to explain, but something deep inside my mind is telling me I can trust them. It, it's a little weird, but somehow I feel like we're bound by fate. Haha. <laughs> Sorry, if that's strange to hear, Killian. Maybe it's just my intuition speaking. Ah, well... I have no qualms with your intuition. In that case, it'd be better if you did this tomorrow. Please feel free to stay the night here, Killian. For, from now on, free of charge. Yes, Killian, thank you so much. We'll meet outside by the bonfire tomorrow. Until then, we should get some rest. See you tomorrow, Killian. All right, cool. So uh, now we can just not pay 450, which we definitely need to do, but... uh. Welcome. Would you like to stay the night? Boom. Okay. Accidentally spent 450, but we needed to, to be fair. And now we go to the bonfire. Nothing to interact with, I don't think. What about the plant pot? Nope. Okay. <laughs> So now, okay, it auto takes us to the campfire. Killian, I hope the inn was to your liking. The eldest and I work hard to make sure it's comfortable for all of our guests. Anyway, we should make our way to the sensei's house as soon as possible. I'll meet you in front of his house. Okay, so luckily we've already pummeled everyone. But something tells me we're going to have to fight more people. No? Okay, well... Uh, I think it's another D to save. And here we go. This is it. I've done this many times before, but it's always so uncomfortable. All right, well, let's try this out. Sensei, it's me, Alita. Please let me in. Just stay calm. We've got this. Oh, so I can just leave? Okay. <laughs> Alita, what is it now? I told you not to come near this house. 
I know, but... Oh. I don't remember inviting you into my house. It must be customary for trainers to waltz into people's houses unannounced. But this is crossing a line. I, it's okay, Sensei. I brought Killian here. And why exactly did you invite them here? Uh, I... No. We came here because we're concerned about you. You've been stuck in this place for months. You haven't left or spoken to anyone. The people in this village are starting to believe that you're abandoning them. No one has said anything outright, but we fear that people will leave soon. That would probably be best anyway. There's no future here. Sensei! How could you? It's all a hopeless endeavor. There's no point in any of this. But I just want to know why. Why won't you talk to us? Why won't you just give us a chance? I just don't know what to do. What's the right answer here? The purpose of Sheridan? The people of Sheridan are here because they trust you. Even in times where things seem grim, you must give them a chance to prove that to you. There are plenty of pure souls out there. You just have to find them. Killian, please meet me in my garden. I wish to speak with you. Alita, if you would just give us a moment. But I'm giving you your chance. Take it. Uh, I understand. Is the sensei sending you off somewhere? This is all so strange. What is the point of this? Okay, well, I think there's going to be a lot of stuff to explore in this house. But... Talia, I try so hard to smile. But that is just impossible. What was her name again? Amelia? Have I confused you? Perhaps you'll recognize me in this state. Familiar? Yes, I believe so. You've come all this way, just to bother a man already in his pit of despair. You're either a despicable child, or clueless. Either way, I've promised Alita that I would give her at least a chance. That's something we all want, don't we? Amelia, it seems her life was left up to that very chance. I bet your friends said something like, If only I were stronger. It's all bullshit. There's nothing that could have been done in that cave. Fate is already written. But perhaps? I am, but I just got here. I am. Hmm. Very good. In that case, listen closely. Do you remember where we met in Amethyst Cave by that bridge? Just west of that bridge is a rock with a pendant attached to it. Touch the stone. If something happens, proceed. The way to Amethyst Grotto will open up, and within this place, the soul stone lies. Is this Avengers? Retrieve the stone and, well, we'll see. And also, you are to do this alone. Leave Alita out of this. Find the soul stone. If you are able to retrieve it, you pass. And also, you are to do this alone. Okay. Well, is the sensei sending you off somewhere? It's all so strange. Hmm. Locked. Also locked. Also locked. Damn. Okay. Well, I think searching for this stone is going to take some time, so I may end this episode here. And I think the next episode I'm going to be uploading is going to be a Pokemon Clover, because I am behind on that now. But, um, yeah. This may be the next Sunday upload, or maybe a Friday one. This might take a while, but uh, a pendant, soul stone, all sounds very interesting. And I very much look forward to uh, playing it. So, if you guys are enjoying, thank you, as always. But please consider leaving a like, subscribing, and commenting down below with any tips or tricks. Should I go and just keep on encountering the Swablu until we get a, a shiny? I think that would be pretty cool. But um, yeah, anyway, 
Stay tuned for the next episode. Have a good one. Take care. And peace.